we are going to talk to a real live vasectomy patient, my husband, <laughs> and get the 411 on the experience of it all about having a vasectomy right from his mouth. Okay, I did not feed him these lines, by the way, y'all. Let's go. <laughs> okay, let's talk about why did you decide to get a vasectomy? Because as the situation was, I had my IUD, which I love. I'm never taking it out, except to exchange it. And that makes us about 98, 99% protected against unwanted pregnancy anyway. So why did you feel like you wanted a vasectomy? You know what, I think um, the situation where is we already had three kids, we are comfortable with having no more kids, you know what I mean, we just want to be extra protected. A second layer of the defense, just in case, you know what I mean, that might happen. So it makes you more comfortable, makes you able to relax better knowing that you can't have any slip ups or always. Okay, so a plan B. I yes. like a man who has a plan A and a plan B and a plan C. All right. So were you nervous the day, okay, vasectomy day, here it is, were you nervous? I think I was a tad bit nervous and I think any man is gonna be a little bit nervous when anybody's poking around down there with Mr. Peter, okay? It was, it's you not know with I mean? Mr. Peter. But at the same time, you know what I mean? I had the privilege of having, been able to have my wife do it. So that made me a little bit more comfortable and able to relax a little bit more. But in total, the procedure was very simple. No pain at all. So once you get in there and you got situated, um, it was totally comfortable. All right, so let me stop and say this, you guys. Uh, do not normally endorse physicians <laughs> taking on their family members as patients, particularly doing procedures on them. This man begged me to Please, can you do the vasectomy? I just want you to do it. I tried to push him on to one of my partners. He really just wanted me to do it. And since it is a very um, routine procedure, I've done it numerous times in the office. He wore me down and I finally said yes. And so yes, I did do your vasectomy. And so yeah, you, <laughs> uh, how, was it, okay, no pain? Come on now, bro. How was the procedure? How painful was it? No pain. I think that's cap. The needle, the inject, you know, the, the little, scale the, of okay. one to ten. Yes. The pain level was a two and a half. All right. Okay. Um, the pain is more mental, getting over the fact that someone's down there messing around in your private area. Mm. That's the mental pain of it. There's no physical pain. Okay. From that standpoint. Okay. All right. He's got a, a good pain tolerance, but yeah. So, all right, and then afterwards, what about like once the numbing medicine wore off and afterwards, that first few days, that first week? You know what, for me, I can only speak for myself, but my wife did mine and I actually coached on the same day. I had a bag of veggies down there, okay? And I wasn't running up and down the field, but I was walking, par walking, and it was no big deal, okay? I just kept the, the veggies there, okay? Put them on ice, all right? Put the privates on ice, and it was no problem at all for me. And I moved outside for, for about two hours and 30 minutes, up and down 100 yards back and forth. So for me, it was no problem afterwards. Um, you know, just make sure you take care of it. You don't want to go into a full out sprint. You want to use a bag of veggies, put it on ice. All Simple right. With that. Okay. So I tried to tell him to take that day off coaching, but he did not listen. Yes. And so he did coach, but no it wasn't days too off. bad. No days off. Okay. Let's talk about the question that always people like worry about. You know, they're afraid to ask their urologist this, but how did it affect your sex life? Like, how was that, you know, afterwards? It. <laughs> That's a myth. It doesn't affect your sex life at all. If anything, as a man, from a man's point of view, it makes your sex life better because you feel more free, okay? You feel more relaxed and free, okay? Because you don't have to worry about any slip ups, okay? All right, in any type of situation. So if anything, it's gonna improve your sex life and make you want it more because you don't have to worry about that 
you're taken care of, you don't have to find yourself in a, any given situation. All right, it's important to say here, everybody, that vasectomies have no way, shape, or form protective against STIs or STDs. Okay, we're talking about pregnancy, so still protect yourself in that manner. It does not prevent STIs or STDs. All right. All right, and so it's safe to say this question, you probably already know the answer. Would you do it again? If I had to, I would do it again every year if I had to. <laughs> it's that simple of a procedure. It's not complicated. Okay, it's very simple. Um, it might take 15, 20 minutes. Okay, depending on how hard it is, um, but it's very simple. No pain, take care of your area with a bag of veggies, okay? Stay low for a day and a half, you're fine. Okay, none like being comfortable, okay? And not have to worry about um, having any slip ups. That's the last thing you want as a, as a man. Keyword, no slip ups. All right, thank you, uh, a patient X husband. I promise I didn't pay him to say this. I mean, <laughs> not like that. So anyway, all right. So make sure you like this video, subscribe, and most importantly, join me next week for another exciting time with your favorite urologist.